Hey YouTubers and welcome back to this channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make an electrostatic levitator using hard drive platters. Hard drive platters, you can just break them right out of a hard drive and then hot glue them onto some circular pieces of plastic. You can use kind of leads or whatever, you know, is maybe just a little bit bigger than the platter. I got a, a straw out of a slushy and just cut it into four equal pieces like that. Now you want to drill some holes in here to put your um, straws in the holes and uh, set up your electrostatic field generator. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, here's it all sized up. And it looks like um, I can adjust the height. I glued the straws at the bottom, but the ones at the top I didn't glue. And I drilled the holes so they would just fit the straws. So it's a little bit snug. So I can kind of move the, I can change the distance between those two plates. So the hard drive platters are on the top and the bottom connected with the, with these two electrical wires. So um, kind of excited to try this out. The high voltage comes from this setup, which is a 555 timer driven flyback transformer. It's, it uses a MOSFET to generate high frequency across the primary of the flyback and puts out about 15 to 20 kilovolts of DC static electric power. Here's a rectangular piece of foil that I just stuck in there. So folks, we have levitation and you do have to adjust the height of the, the distance between the two charged plates. An octagonal shape, which so far seems to be working the best. Here's another shape, kind of a pill shape. Spinning around. Now for testing a styrofoam ball with foil on it. Let's see what happens. Oh, look, it bounces. It flows itself out of there. Interesting. Anyway, um, do appreciate you checking in on this channel and seeing how you can make a simple electrostatic levitator using the computer hard drive platters. Uh, it's cheap stuff. Straws are cheap. The only thing that you've got to spend some money on and dig around for a schematic is this. And I can send you the schematic for that if you're interested in making this. Anyway, uh, please do check back and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Happy experimenting, and see you back later.